This video is sponsored by Vikings War of Clans, a very fun game which I have in fact been playing a lot of over the past few days. It is extremely addictive and I know you guys are going to love it too, plus it's free to download and available on iOS and Android devices. So download Vikings War of Clans by clicking the link in the video description or on screen now. What is going on guys, my name is Chaotic and welcome back to another Grand Theft Auto 5 video. Now in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys an easter egg in GTA 5 which references the game Fallout 3. The easter egg itself is fairly small, but it's an easter egg nevertheless. So let's go ahead and get straight into things. So to view this easter egg, what you want to do is make your way inside the military base and you want to locate one of these packs of boxes and barrels all held together with ratchet straps. Now there are in fact a number of different locations around the military base where you can find one of these but once you've located one, go ahead and take a look at the text on the boxes themselves. Now most of the text doesn't have any significance but the smaller text in the middle of the writing does. And the text which does have significance is PB3000-VLT101. Now to most people that haven't played Fallout before, this may not mean anything to you, but for those of you that have and have some knowledge of the game, I'm sure you guys already know what this means. So first of all, PB3000 stands for Pip-Boy 3000. It's basically a model of Pip-Boy, and I do have an image on screen right now just showing you guys what this looks like. Then as for VLT101, that stands for Vault 101. Vault 101 is basically a nuclear bunker involved in the storyline. Now many of you watching this video right now may not understand the significance of this easter egg, and I guess to understand it, you do have to be a player of Fallout, but I'm sure there are many of you also questioning why would Rockstar include an easter egg to another game they do not make or own? Well as I'm sure you guys know, there are in fact a number of easter eggs in GTA 5 itself, referencing other games and movies the Rockstar doesn't directly make or own. So this reference isn't the first or only easter egg that has been found in GTA 5 referencing something else the Rockstar doesn't directly make. Plus what you may also not know, inside the latest Fallout game Fallout 4 there are in fact a number of easter eggs also referencing GTA 5. One of those being the church in Polito Bay. A dead body can also be found in the game resembling the character Trevor from GTA 5 and there are also a few other easter eggs as well. But there we go guys, that is pretty much it for this easter egg. Like I said, nothing major, but nevertheless it is still an easter egg referencing Fallout 3. I'm not currently aware of any other easter eggs in the game referencing Fallout 3 or any of the Fallout games, but if you guys do know of any, go ahead and leave a comment on this video. And it would also be greatly appreciated if you guys could also take a few seconds out of the video click the like button as it helps me out a lot. And if you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, I would recommend that you do, because I upload all the latest and the greatest Grand Theft Auto five content. So once again, thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys next time.